What up, fam? Mr. Country CEO back in the house, man. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Uh, it is Saturday morning. I'm coming on here to give y'all uh, some game and update. I won't be live with you this morning. I got to go teach a uh, leadership class to youth leaders. So that's my task this morning in the other arena that I do flow in. But I didn't want to leave you guys without a little something to think about on this Saturday morning. Look, first of all, I want to pronounce and proclaim that this week was a great week, right? Uh, I think I told you last three were good weeks. We're on a, we a four-week run now. We have had three good weeks, and then I can say that this week was a great week, right? Watch this, what I'm about to tell you, and then it still was a great week. The 23 quad axle Mac. Start having transmission issues yesterday morning about nine o'clock. The boy made one low, come back, and then uh, Cole came up, say check transmission. Got my mechanic down there, looked at everything, pulled the code up, and it's a wiring harness, uh, either the external one or in the inner valve body of the transmission. So we tried it out, got another load to see what it do it again. Sure enough, it did it again, and so we got it on over to the uh, Allison. Uh, guy yesterday evening, he started, uh, did, wasn't the external, so he's got to go in it. Uh, hopefully mid-morning Monday, it'll be fixed. Nothing serious. Uh, just one of those things, the wiring harness got a short. All right. All right. But it still was a great week, right? That truck made all week and still going to get at least five hours yesterday, so I ain't tripping. All right. Uh, nothing going the weekend, but it still was a great week. Uh, I worked, y'all, just to demonstrate the the magnitude of the work. I worked for nine different contractors this week. You hear me? Nine different contractors this week. CEO, why are you doing that? Well, I like to spread myself around. Why is that a good thing? Because if you put too many trucks with one contractor, that contractor cancels out, machine get broken, anything crazy happens. Look at all those trucks that you uh, get knocked off one job, right? So I like to spread myself around no more than three or four at a time unless, um, you know, there's an opportunity there or it's a little slow and I need to do that, right? But I love to spread them around three or four different spots. That's, that's, the, that's the luxury. That's the beauty of uh, having multiple trucks. So you can be able to serve more than one customer and your company can grow like that. All right, but that's just a little tidbit on that, right? So finally, uh, next week, I want to let you guys know the videos are going to be focused. So I always get this question, CEO, how much money it takes, man, to get started on this thing? We're going to break down some videos next week on dealing with the financial aspect of this dump truck business, what you need, how much you got to have, what going to cost it, all that good stuff. So tune in next week, definitely dealing with the money part of this business. What does it take to get started? You know, how much does it take to maintain? How much does it take to grow? You know, all that good stuff, right? So stay tuned for that. And then just a little bonus uh, question or thought for you. Because I've been asking you the last couple of weeks, especially on the lives. Uh, the live before last was leaving your job, right, to uh, start this dump truck business. Hit me up in the comments. Tell me, where are you on that? What are your thought process on that? How? What have you been thinking about that? And then on last of the week's live, we talked about praying, preparing, having passion, and that kind of thing, those kinds of things, right? The kind, I, I wanted to deal with the right mindset that is needed to be successful in this, before you even get started, right? You got to have the right mindset going into something because if you don't, your mind can uh, sabotage what you're trying to do. Oh, 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 that's a nugget right there. Dump truck business, South Louisiana. Fourth week in a row, great. It was a great one. It stepped up to a great status in my book. Already booked out for Monday and next week. Weather looks good. We trying to work on week number five. And I don't like to count my chips before I get them, but one day at a time. And uh, we on a steady march right now. You heard me? Y'all hit the like, subscribe, notification bell. Uh, proud to put some shorts out this evening. Uh, after I get back to my office about one and uh, got a pile of paperwork. Uh, out of those nine, I probably got about six invoices to do. I love it. I love going through those invoices like that because that lets me know I ain't got to wonder. It was a great week, y'all. Y'all be good. I'm out of here. I'm gone.